Well, good morning. This morning I'm showing you how I make coffee when I'm camping. Okay, so step number one is you need to fill up a water bottle about how much coffee you want. For me, it's this guy. Thanks, Ronnie. Got this for me for my birthday. Uh, and so I fill that all the way up to the top. Then from there, I stick it into this little, this little, I don't know, water thing that I found on Amazon for like 10 bucks. It's really collapsible. This little guy right here, it just collapses down. You can see all those little ridges and I'm just heating up the water. So while that is happening, then I go back to this guy and I stick on my little pour over machine that I found. All right, so here she is. But the reason I got this one is because it holds number four filters. So uh, it will fit more coffee that way. So now once you have that guy, you just stick it right on here like that. And then you put your number four filter on. Okay, all I did was just stick this filter in there. Then an important step is you need to wet down the filter to make sure that the coffee isn't what's wetting it down. So then, once it's wet down, just kind of dump out the extras, get rid of it. So now your coffee filter's wet. All right, four scoops of coffee. Okay, so now this is where it gets a little tricky. What you wanna do, you look in here and you see the coffee. You wanna pour around the outside and get all the beans wet without touching the paper. Looks like our coffee, our water's about ready here. So just like this. Just enough to activate the beans, you wanna get the water in there. then let it set for 30 seconds. Okay, now the beans are activated, so pour the rest of the water in, once again without touching the paper. And once you get all the beans wet, right in the center, and in it goes. Okay, then once it's all drained, you just remove the filter, clean out your tools, and pour coffee into your favorite camping mug. For me, it's this one. All right, that is it for today. We are camping up, or packing up camp, and headed to Eureka Springs. Apparently that is a motorcycle city, so that's where we're going. <laughs>